Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel, Canada Immigration. We hope you're doing great. In this video, we will talk about navigating the IRCCDR program, what we know amidst vague announcements. As immigration policies continue to evolve, the IRCCS Temporary Resident Program has become a focal point for many prospective visitors and temporary residents in Canada. Despite its significance, recent announcements from the IRCC have been characterized by a lack of specific details and timelines, leaving many applicants feeling uncertain about their prospects. In this video, we'll explore the current landscape of the TR program, shedding light on what we do know amidst the vagueness, and what it might mean for future applicants seeking to navigate this complex system. If you are interested in this topic, so, to get all the information, Pay attention and watch the video through to the end please hit like and subscribe, and don't forget to push the notification bell for an upcoming video. So, without any further delay, let's jump into the video. Navigating the Uncertainty of the IRCCDR Program Announcements In recent months, Immigration, Refugees and Citizenship Canada has made several vague announcements regarding its temporary resident program, leaving many potential applicants frustrated and confused. With statements like we'll be announcing later in the fall, it raises the question, why not provide the necessary details now? The inconsistency in messaging and lack of clarity only serves to fuel speculation among applicants, who are eager for concrete information. The promise of eligibility for graduates One of the announcements that has been made involves the eligibility of graduates from public colleges. Those who complete programs linked to occupations in long-term shortage will continue to be eligible for up to three years of post-graduation work permits. This is a positive development, especially for graduates entering the workforce in sectors facing labor shortages. However, the announcement is lacking in crucial details. What specific criteria will be used to define occupations in long-term shortage? Will there be a list of eligible programs? Without this context, applicants are left to guess and interpret what this could mean for their circumstances. Inconsistent messaging and lack of clarity. Compounding this issue is the inconsistency in how dates are presented in IRCC communications. In some instances, specific timelines are mentioned, while in others, they are conspicuously absent. For example, the recent mention of English language requirements for post-graduation work permits lacks clarity. While it has been stated that English proficiency is necessary, there has been no distinction made between academic and general language assessments. This ambiguity leads to confusion for many applicants trying to navigate the requirements, and it only adds to the overall sense of uncertainty. Unfulfilled promises, the case of working hours for international students. Moreover, the lack of follow-up on previous announcements only deepens this frustration. A classic example occurred earlier this year when the Minister of Immigration, Mark Miller, indicated that international students would soon be allowed to work 24 hours per week. As we find ourselves in the fall season, that announcement remains unfulfilled, with the working hours still capped at 20 hours. Such delays in implementation, combined with a lack of additional updates, leave applicants questioning the reliability of IRCC communications. The IRCC must follow through on its promises, as the ability to work more hours can significantly impact international students' financial situations. Speculation and misinformation, the role of immigration agents. The situation is further complicated by the lack of updates on new pathways for permanent residency for Tier 4 and Tier 5 occupations, which have been mentioned in passing but remain shrouded in silence. Immigration agents and consultants have begun speculating and creating their programs based on scant information. This can mislead potential applicants and create a chaotic environment where misinformation proliferates. When agents and consultants fill the information void with their interpretations, it can lead to confusion and even exploitation of vulnerable applicants who are simply trying to navigate the immigration process. Caregiver program changes, a silent promise. Another significant announcement that went quiet was regarding changes to the caregiver program, which was supposed to allow caregivers to transition to permanent residency immediately upon arrival in Canada. Despite this promising prospect, no additional information or criteria have been released, leaving those in the caregiver sector in limbo. Caregivers play a vital role in supporting families and communities, and clarity on their pathway to permanent residency is essential not just for the caregivers themselves but for the families that depend on them. The need for clear communication. Given the complexities surrounding immigration policies, the IRCC needs to provide clear, detailed updates when changes are announced. The current approach making vague statements without accompanying specifics, creates unnecessary confusion and speculation, ultimately hindering the very individuals the program aims to support. Conclusion. A call for transparency and clarity. 
providing comprehensive guidelines and clear timelines from the outset would not only build trust but also allow applicants to make informed decisions about their futures in Canada. As the fault progresses, the IRCC must step up its communication efforts and provide the clarity that applicants desperately need. Clear communication can foster a more positive relationship between the IRCC and applicants, alleviating fears and reducing confusion in what is already a daunting process. By addressing these gaps in communication, the IRCC can enhance its credibility and assist potential residents in navigating the complexities of immigration with confidence. In conclusion, while the IRCC's announcements regarding the temporary resident program may leave much to be desired in terms of clarity and timelines, staying informed and proactive is essential for potential applicants. Understanding the broader context and being aware of any updates or changes can empower individuals as they navigate the complexities of the immigration process. As we await more definitive information, it's crucial to remain engaged and prepared, ensuring that you're ready to seize any opportunities that may arise in the future. That is all for today, in this video. What are your thoughts on this? Please let us know in the comments section below. Thanks for watching the entire video. Hopefully, the information is useful to you. See you later, in the next video. Till then, take care.